A single page template is a template that you can use to control the layout of your pages on your WordPress website. And Seedprod makes that very easy to control and do with our drag and drop editor. Let's go ahead and I'm gonna show you how to create your own single page templates. Right now I have a clean installation of WordPress and on the left hand side I have Seedprod already installed. We have videos on the website and the YouTube channel on how to get started and install Seedprod. I'm using the pro version for this video. First off, we need a website that we can actually practice with and use. So I'm going to go to Seedprod and Theme Builder here. And at the top, we have Theme Template Kits. So we could create our templates from scratch here. I just want to get all of the other templates in here, like our header and our footer, just so we can work with those. And we have a starter theme here. I'm just going to import this one here. All right, now we can see all of our pages here. I can just list them by alphabetical. So for example, we have our blog, index, our archives, and search. So this is one template that will handle all of those pages. We have our footer template, and this will appear on our entire website. So we have conditions on where these templates will appear. And if we come down to the bottom, we have a single page template here already. What I'm actually gonna do is just delete this one and we'll create one from scratch. On the top right corner here, we can see enable seed rod theme. Let's go ahead and enable this. And if we check out the front page, we should have a website design here. There we go, we can see our starter theme. So this is using the home page template. So we wanna use a single page template for all of the sub pages. For example, our about page and contact page, which we don't have created yet. Let's actually come back and go to pages and add new. So we actually need a few pages to test with. So let's just go ahead and create some test pages. So here's an about us page. You can put your information here and you can put any content you wish in here, buttons, uh, whatever you wish. You can put lists, you can put short codes to other plugins if you need. It's just a normal page that you can create content on. So I'll just add a couple little test things here and we'll go ahead and publish this page. There we go, if we check this out, we can check the page and there's no template you found. That's because we haven't created it yet. And we deleted the one that already came with it. Let's go ahead and close this. And we can actually close this one as well for now. All right, let's close out here. And we'll come back and we'll create another page. So I'll go to pages and add new. Let's create a contact us page. All right, there we go. I'll keep it quite simple. And we'll go ahead and publish this one as well. All right, great. So we have two pages here. These are sub pages and we need a template to control how those look and feel. Let's go to seed prod on the left hand side and theme builder. Let's go up top here and we have add new theme template. We can call this single page. We can give this a name. I'll call this single page custom. I add custom just so that I know that I created it and it didn't come with the theme template by itself. For the type, let's go ahead and select single page. And there is a priority here. This is only useful if you have multiple single page templates that are competing with each other. So you could list one a higher priority than the other if you needed. We also have the conditions and we wanna include this on all of our pages. So this template specifically will target all pages. You can change this for anything with posts, categories, tags. So this is how you would create different templates for different parts of your website. Let's go ahead and save this. And this will bring us to the Seedprod page builder where we can drag in the template tags needed. These are dynamic tags used on the single page template. So let's create a simple layout here. I'll just create a basic two column layout. So we have content on the left and we can put a sidebar on the right. On the left hand side, let's click up here to go back to our blocks and we can add the post title. So here's the hello world. Let's go ahead and we can align this to the left. I'll just keep this very simple for now. Let's go ahead and get our post content. We'll drop that in here. And again, we can make sure that's aligned properly. It looks good to me. And what this is gonna do is the title will dynamically change based on what the page name is. So for example, about us or contact us. You can see when you click on this, it actually adds a tag here and it'll replace that tag with the content. Here it has a tag here for the title and these are dynamic tags. Now you can change this layout however you wish and you can add whatever you wish. So for example, if we come down to advanced, we can take an opt-in form and we could show this at the bottom of all the content. Here you can add in the details and you can connect it to your favorite third-party email marketing service. I have a sidebar here as well, which you can add whatever you wish. So you could actually create a sidebar template, a template part using the template parts template here. We, we can pop this in, hit block settings, and we have a drop down here. And we actually have a sidebar that came with the template. And again, you can create your own sidebars as well if you need to. Let's go ahead and save this and we can exit out. And if we check out our pages, we go to pages, all pages. We have these two, we have about us. Let's go ahead and open this. And now you can see we applied that single page template to the about us page. And you can see I have my nonsense content inside here. This is the content, the custom title. We have our opt-in form here and then the sidebar part. If we come back, we can do the same thing with contact us. We can open this and you can see that I have my contact us page with my content in here, the sidebar and the opt-in. So you can completely customize this however you wish. And that's how you go ahead and create your own custom single page templates using Seaprod. Makes it very simple.